Oh man, Erdmon versus Striker. This is actually going to be epic. I'm going to see if we can find a Zerg caster. Oh, let him know one second. One sec. Trying to find me a second person. Also, I'm going to grab some water. <laughs> Everybody comes in and comments on the heat. Yeah. Ugh, it is a sweat box. All right, we're ready. Ready. So, I'm actually kind of glad to cast with you because I want to hear more about your style and more on your insights on ZDZ. Oh, really? Yeah. Because everyone here is like, Kaido's amazing. And I'm like, Kaido's the one guy that I haven't seen in a lot of other tournaments. Mm. Who's, he, who's he playing? So, we got so, Urban versus Striker, oh, okay, which should okay. be a great so game. ZBZ, okay. Yeah. So this is what. Um, what is it? Um, her, where our toast is set to face next. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, Urban bottom left and corner. Uh, sorry, striker bottom left and corner is the blue zerg up right and corner. We got Urban as the yeah. red zerg. This is in the losers bracket. Urban um, actually has very entertaining ZVZ. If yeah, you've ever watched yeah. his stream, he'll throw out all sorts of craziness, and yeah. I feel like his zerg versus zerg is actually his strongest matchup. That oh really? I didn't know that. That being yeah. said, he's going up against Striker, and Striker is one of the top four, I would say here. Yeah, uh, yeah, he's he's probably the number two most skilled player right now, like right after Gypsy. Right after. That's what I would uh, assume. Yeah. But I think generally both players are pretty standard. Um, they they like to do twelve pool. It's kind of, it'll be kind of funny to see both of them doing like any aggressive build uh, in the early game. But I think I think both should be doing. Um, Overpool since it, since it's because it's four player map especially. Uh, have you? So I, I doubt Urban's gonna go for Hydra build on this map. But have you ended up playing uh, Urban a bit on ZBZ on ladder at all? No, I actually never played Urban. Uh, he actually ladders at all times. Like he doesn't play all in like non Korean times. Gotcha. Like I play in Korean times. Oh, that, that's why I guess uh, oh, okay, I don't, I don't really like meet him. Like I play during like when Artosis plays actually. So it's like we got an overpool for striker to start. So it looks like um, so it looks like Hermann's going twelve half. So so basically, his point of view is he knows striker is a better player, so he's gonna gamble and go greedy. And striker on the underhand is going overpool. And this right here is a counter, basically. Hermann won the build right now. So it'll be it'll be kind of be it'll be interesting to see how striker overcomes this. Yeah. yeah, I think the I heard someone say I'm not sure how true it is these days with a lot of the meta yeah. works, but they whoever puts the pool last ends up winning. Mm. Oh, what they say, okay. yeah. Okay. Um, I do. Uh, one thing I do like yeah. about the nine pool uh, mm. and over pool openers is there is a degree of flexibility, uh, mm. to, and you know what you need to do. Like I feel like once you're in the situation, the game is laid out for you. You know what you need to do. Yeah. Because uh, you're the aggressor, it's mm -hmm. up to you. It looks like we do have a, a hatch follow up. Yeah. Um, for Urban though, mm -hmm. uh, this is the dark arts of ZBZ, honestly. This is like, okay, you know you're going to have uh, the natural expansion advantage. Yep. Um, you know, but are you going to dedicate, what are you dedicating and when? And this is where I love insights from high, high level players from you. Yeah. It, it almost feels like a lot of it, particularly like the other matchups, mm -hmm. I feel like it's figured, it's, it's like you do this, 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 whatever. But for Zerg, it just so much feels like it's like for field. It's yeah, like it's, by gut. it's like right now they're both in the dark. This is cross bond. So like right now, like as you can see, Striker is trying to like scout um, both actually spawn. Like he's trying to scout this uh, cross. I think he's trying to scout the other position. I'm not sure. Oh yeah, yeah. So he's so I think he saw the Overlord bottom right hand corner, and since he sees oh, the Overlord, see, he see, knows see, that he yeah, needs yeah, to send yeah. the Zerglings yeah, yeah. out to the natural. 
and so, at this stage yeah. he's going to see a completed so, hatchery yeah. and uh, I think the funny thing is once he sees, sees this he's already invested into wings okay so that's that's good I think so he's going to try to like uh, cause some some like change here he's going to try to uh, take the lead here looks like Urban uh, has dedicated a good amount of zerglings in the build already so like uh, I think striker yeah yeah I anyway, striker is try just trying to dro drone up and just go standard as much as possible. I'm not sure like what Herman is intending to do. Maybe all in Ling Rush. Maybe yeah. But I think right now Herman is still in good spot. I think detecting yeah. that layer creates a little bit more of an ambiguity because sometimes we, yeah when I think yeah. the standard thing to do once you see twelve hatch is that it's going to be a Ling all in. But maybe mm -hmm. Herman opt saying okay this is a four player map it's mm -hmm. cross position yeah. Uh, let me go ahead and make sure that I get that layer yeah. up. Ooh. A few drones being tacked off the layer, uh, or sorry, the spire dropping, it looks like that's going to be ahead of Striker for quite a bit. It's um, about the same. But yeah, but a little so bit faster, I guess. 10 seconds yeah. here or there, which will, and it looks mm -hmm. like there's also a drone that was dedicated mm -hmm. uh, to create a sunken colony, so a little bit more defensible for Striker, but about 10 second air time, mm -hmm. five, 10 seconds uh, for Urban when he's going to have those Mutalisks out. But both players have I gotta think, uh, say, think st stabilizing a little bit. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. Because we got, what, nine drones mining overall. So, I think we got uh, just about that, plus the Zergling that's yeah, creating think, some chaos back there. I think there. probably has like one or two more drones, which is really big in ZBZ. Yep. There's such a high variance in this matchup. So, uh, so I think Striker is uh, trying to pressure with Lings. I, I guess trying to, trying, oh wait, actually. He might actually be able to bust. No, never. Oh, he didn't even go speed. <laughs> he's he's really greedy. So striker saw that. Um, Striker's probably tilted right now because he <laughs> he saw like there's no speed. Um, Looks like that zergling yeah. uh, got the kill in the main. Still hanging out yeah. there. Spire just about to finish here. You can kind of get the good. So yeah, about uh, 100 100 HP. I'm not sure what that turns into. Urban able to see the spire timing on the opposite side. Mm -hmm. Zergling's crouching in, and Urban feeling comfortable enough that he's gonna go ahead and grab that second gas. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, I'm not sure. Like right now, like from my perspective, Herman is in really good spot. Up ten He's supply. In really good spot. Like he should be able to make three or more meters like outright. Like right now. And it feels like yeah. once you get that ball rolling, it can. Yeah. But it, it just depends on like how they do in, in micro. Okay, so like another yeah. zergling able to get into the. So he's gonna see three. Yeah, like. The, like Gonna see, see the three yeah. needles at the very least. Is he able to get he a drone is. kill though? Is he gonna get the kill? Oh, got that was big. Kill. That was big. Did he get the drone kill? I think he got the drone. Oh yeah, that was huge. I think they have the same drone count now. I think. Oh, hold on. Let's yeah. get a good drone. Good look at the drone here. Yeah. Let's see. So he has. I think. I think he has um, twelve drones there. So and we got here. Uh, sixteen drones. So Herman still has. Actually, Striker has about the same drone count. So it just at this point, it's just all about in the muta micro. Like we'll see who's the aggressor here. Um, Urban up a mutalisk. It looks like and two supply after those last exchanges. He's starting to move out yeah. with the scourge. So you know, Herman knows that he went whole hat. So he has the advantage, but he should be careful with these set of mutas and scourges because by the time he arrives at striker's net, striker might have enough to defend. This is going to come down so to some seven micro. Meters. And how many minutes does um, Herman has? He uh, has okay, six. Okay, six minutes. Okay, okay, let's see. Let's see how uh, Striker micro is. Okay, cool. Oh, oh, okay. So how many meters? Okay, six. Herman has what? How many? Five. Okay, okay so Striker won this, I think. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on. Uh, okay, okay, Striker won this. <laughs> Striker won that heavily. Striker won this. Um, he's going to try to attack from behind constantly, chasing the meters. That might be the now, game shifting maneuver. Now, Another um, Scourge land. Striker is massively ahead of this game. Oh, wait, 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 man. Oh, man, that was... So critically, we've got at least two Mutalisks here in Striker's attack force, yeah. where Urban, it looks like he engaged and landed with some Scourge. Yep. But beyond that, Striker just focused fire the Mutalisks mm -hmm. much more efficiently than Urban did. And as a result, Striker has these two Mutalisks left that just have a sliver of health, where he was be able to just chew through Urban's Mutalisks uh, yeah. more rapidly. So really nice engage there by Striker from uh, a defensive position. And yeah, now just it, storming it the base. Pretty much game over. I mean, as you can see, like the supply count is just way too ahead for Striker. Too many Zerglings. Yeah. That's I mean, Hermann's trying to counter, as you can see at that, but yeah, it's just too. Yeah. I think that's it. All right, gonna move on to game two. Is it best of three? Uh, yes. Oh, okay. I believe. 
not sure if it's best of three. Is this a loser bracket as well? It's, 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 a, it's a loser's bracket, but I'm not sure if it's... Who knocked down uh, yeah. Striker? Actually, I knocked down Striker. Nice. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Wait for game yeah, two. let's see where game two is. I'm guessing, especially after that start, that Ermon's going to want to look at the replay and see what happened. Mm, yeah. But I'm thinking it was probably just, uh, from my point of view, it was just a focus fire issue. Yeah. I think what Herman should have done is he should have just um, not growth up to Ooh. 11 meters and then just attack. Thank you for letting me know, chat. Need to update the score. Striker. Striker. Yeah. So C S T R. Yeah. That, yeah. 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 yeah that, that is correct. Yeah. Oh. I think her mom might be watching her play. I mean, he's been playing really well this land, like pushing Artosis to the brink. Yeah, he was my dark horse coming into this. It was like I oh, think really, really. will surprise some people. He's been grinding a lot with his broken um, uh, his elbow. Arm, yeah. yeah. The dedication is pretty respectful. Gone pretty deep. Yeah. Ooh. I kind of want to see where the while we're waiting. Let's go ahead see and take the, a look at what yeah. the bracket's at. So right now, I think Jayun's playing Nyokin right now. Um, is the lower bracket best of one? I think so. It is best of one. Okay, so Urban just got eliminated. Yeah, so I, who's he 